we are doing the Back to Eden garden style. And so we are, uh, we tilled this up the first year last year. Josh tilled this area of the ground. We pulled the weeds out of it. From there, he covered it with mulch and we planted in it. Over the winter, there was nothing planted in it. Everything had died off. So what we did was we pulled the mulch back and we threw our kitchen scraps into this pile um, and into a pile over there, 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 and that patch there. And we composted directly into our garden beds through the winter. Um, at the start of the year, we covered everything really well with an extra layer of fresh mulch. And come time to plant all of the uh, peppers and tomatoes and stuff, it is so much simpler to just pull back the soy or the, uh, the wood chips to plant in them than it is to um, try to dig up and till up new dirt every single year. And this dirt is going to be very nutrition dense because we, we've just been feeding it that whole past season. So everything is really taking very well in it. Um, it's very surprisingly soft to even walk on. I avoided walking on it all last year. Um, but yeah, it's, it's been really nice. It's a really good way to save yourself a crap ton of money and energy when it comes to gardening. Um, gardening does not have to be a super laborious task if you do it smart and try to learn all the different ways to be more efficient in the process because there are so many ways to make gardening easier. Um, so if you start a garden, do yourself a favor and look into the back to eating garden style because that is the one I would highly recommend. And that's everything you guys. Cannot wait another month and things are going to be <laughs> a lot bigger. There's going to be a lot more fruit coming out of the garden even. Um, and we're going to start seeing a lot of colors popping out. I mean, just a rainbow array of colors. We've got yellow tomatoes, red tomatoes, pink tomatoes, orange tomatoes. I've got purple peppers, orange peppers, red peppers, green peppers. You name it. <laughs> I've got sunflowers, multicolored sunflowers. So the garden is just going to be an absolute beautiful array of colors. Praise God for his absolutely just gorgeous design. <laughs> I hope you guys have a blessed day. Thanks for checking this out.